Also right now, a public health emergency is in effect due to the statewide flu outbreak. As CBS 42 News reporter Tim Reed tells us tonight, the flu epidemic has really hit hard on the University of Alabama campus in Tuscaloosa. The flu outbreak is so bad on Alabama's campus that many workers here at the Student Health Center are wearing one of these to prevent getting sick. Uh, thank you. Healthcare workers have been busy treating six students at the University of Alabama. 1,100 students have tested positive for flu and pneumonia since December. My throat, um, I had a fever, a little bit of cough. Taylor Bensel does not have the flu, but she does have a sinus infection. Like many other students, she decided to pay a visit to the Student Health Center to get checked out. I was pretty concerned that's what brought me to Student Health Center. I mean, every time I check my phone, I'm getting another notification that somebody else died of the flu or all my friends are getting the flu. Nurse practitioners tell us a big problem this year is that the flu vaccine is not as effective and it's easy to spread from one person to another. But nurses here are doing their best to get students feeling better. Put them on the Tamiflu, take them out of class, push their fluids, um, Tylenol, Advil. It's a similar situation over at DCH Hospital. One week ago, nearly 1,000 people came to the emergency room with flu symptoms. 258 of those have the flu. Officials are asking folks to limit hospital visits to reduce the spread of the illness. Well, I hate that so many people are getting sick. Um, the flu is not a fun disease to have. The Alabama Department of Public Health is investigating 53 deaths statewide as a result of the flu. In Tuscaloosa, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.